If you're using IntelliJ IDEA 2016.3 to work on a large spring project, the first thing you'll notice is performance improvements. But as well as this, you'll see numerous new features and bug fixes for working with Spring. If you're creating a new Spring Boot project with Spring Initializer, you'll see the wizard has been completely reworked to cater for the ever-growing number of options available. The dependencies are logically grouped to make it easier to navigate, and on the right you'll see the options you selected. You can still select the Spring Boot version and search for a specific dependency. IntelliJ IDEA 2016.3 supports the new meta annotations from Spring 4.3. For example, the annotations for request mapping, like post mapping and get mapping. These annotations reduce boilerplate and simplify your code. Of course, path variables work as expected too. Support for the property sources annotation has also been added so you can navigate to the property files and have the code help you expect when using properties from these files. And if you've defined an auto-wired meta annotation, IntelliJ IDEA now correctly detects this and offers the expected auto-wired functionality. If your meta annotation takes a property placeholder, you can now inject the property placeholder language. This gives you code completion on the property keys and lets you view the value. There are lots more changes in IntelliJ IDEA 2016.3 to support Spring projects. Take a look.